Hey everyone, this is Ruthambra and with me we, we have to do the community ambassador for Sony Laplex. Hello. So, yeah. Hello. Hi everybody. You can see the tree at the back. Yeah, do you want to talk? Yeah, no. come on to this way, no? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Okay. So tell us what is this community ambassador? I mean, we have brand ambassadors. We have Karan Johar doing uh, Colors Infinity. So what is community ambassador for Karan? I think uh, what uh, Sony Laplex wants to do and mm. what they asked me to be a co-creator of is uh, they want to launch a channel mm. which is uh, going to create a community mm. of people that watch movies yes. because it, the film, uh, I mean the, the mm. channel has 400 amazing films out of wow. which 200 are um, award winning films like 500 awards between mm. 200 films so it's huge. <laughs> uh, they have very intelligent and very mm. well packaged uh, cinema driven yes. content whether it's behind the scenes whether it's biographies mm. whether it's interestingly done trivia yeah. it's basically a film a, a channel for uh, mm. a, a packaging Hollywood yes. cinema in a very interesting way and what they want to do is they want to create a space and they want to create a, mm. a discussion on yeah. cinema and film and they want uh, it on their page and uh, they want me to help create that so I'm quite excited. So you know you've been surrounded by films all your life mm -hmm. like from a kid to where you are you're directing movies now so which movies would you call to be the biggest influencers for you like you know there has to be this one film that inspired you to be. I think if I have to take that one film that yes. I kind of on some level I mean I, I, I'm a movie buff and I've watched movies all my life hmm. uh, so there are many movies I love and hmm. many movies I watch and repeat and hmm. Favorite list, but that one film I think that said, Okay, I can make movies and I should make movies, hmm. and it was Salam Bombay, you know. Because, yes. uh, yeah, it just came at a time where I didn't know what I wanted to do. I, I, I was interested in film, but the hmm. cinema was so bad here, and then you know, so you don't know if you'll fit in, yes. And then you see a movie like Salam Bombay, and it's like you can make anything you want, yeah, you know. So I think that, that I would give credit to that movie, yeah. But you also come from a family of people who have been involved in film all their lives. So, mm -hmm. you know, was there any pressure in you when you, you know, even thought of joining the films? Was there like, oh, no, no, my parents don't pressure us. <laughs> Man, they don't pressure us. <laughs> so as we've heard, your next film is about rappers. So how, how important is music for you? I love music. Mm -hmm. I love music. I have absolutely no musical talent. <laughs> I can't sing. I can't hold a tune in a bucket. I, I cannot play any instrument. But I absolutely love music. So uh, I listen to it and mm. I think it kind of, uh, uh, I listen to music every day, uh, you know what I mean, I, like it, it's part of my life, you know, like I, I relate to, there are genres and there are mm. artists and uh, music is memory and yes. music is nostalgia and music is romance and music mm. is, you know, p uh, calming me down and centering yes. me and music peps me up when I need a morning of pep. Yes. Music is a, a huge part of my life. So, uh, uh, yeah. I mean, I don't go, I don't think I ever have gone a day without listening to music. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So with this, it also marks your debut kind of on the television with coming and taking, you know, more honors from the films to the television industry as well. Mm -hmm. So what about digital? Are you going to experiment with digital? Yes, soon? I want to experiment with digital. I think it's an insanely amazing medium. I think also in this country, it allows you to do more than yes. you can actually on film and TV. Hmm. So uh, it is a medium I definitely want to dabble in. Reema Karthi yes. and me are working on two uh, web series right now. Let's see how it goes. Yeah. So, uh, if, so this is a quick thing. So I'll ask you. I'll ask you about, you know, what movie would you watch for each of these moods? Okay. Yeah? Okay. Are you up for it? Yeah, I'll try it. Yeah. <laughs> it could be any movie. Yeah. It could be a foreign film, Hindi, English, yeah. whatever. So, so, so when you're done and you need a pick me up. When yeah. I'm down and I need a pick, pick me, me up. up. Uh, when I'm down and I need a pick me up. Yes. So I like movies that are like... Um, uh, like the Breakfast Club, that were old for me. Yes, you know. Uh, but then I even like a movie like Full Monty is amazing. Uh -huh. You know, like I like movies that uh, uh, that have that feel good factor at the end. You hmm. know, that 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 picks me up. A movie when you uh, you know you just want to be isolated but not dark. Just you know you want to get into that groove of thinking and everything. If I want to get into the groove of thinking, I won't watch what a movie. You want? No. If I get in the groove of thinking, I listen to music. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Uh, a movie for all occasions. Like, you know, it does not matter. You're busy. You're doing something. You're free. But if it's on TV or if it's there. Godfather please. and Scarface. Godfather? I can watch it at any time. And Scarface. And Scarface. I can watch it anytime. Like, if it's on right now, and from wherever it is on, <laughs> I will watch it. One film that taught you the most, like, you know, about life. Like one film. One movie that taught me about life. Yeah, some life lesson that might have taught you. Um, oh God. We all learn uh, from cinema. I think The Wizard of Oz. Yeah. Huh? Brain, heart, courage. 
And yeah, I think Wizard of Oz. I mean, if I have to take a message, because in the end, she, you know, Glinda yeah, the Good Witch says, yeah, the power's always in you. Yeah. You just had to know it. So I think The Wizard of Oz. It was my childhood favorite film. And one film that you feel should be adapted from Hollywood to Bollywood, like proper adaptation, which would appeal to and penetrate across the Indian cinema. There's so many, but if I had an idea, I wouldn't give it out. Okay, okay, that's not coming. Yeah. <laughs> and which film, or from Bollywood to Hollywood? Uh, there's so many. You know what I mean? Like we have yeah. some amazing films but that one. can totally translate. Uh, one that comes to you right now. One that comes to me right now. Yes. Um, God. <laughs> uh, I, I. Your movie, maybe Farhan's movie, uh, maybe Agni Path. Yeah. I'll just say Zindagi. Oh right yeah. yeah, that would be fun. Yeah. That would be yeah. right. So thank you so much thank for talking you. to us, thank and you. we hope that you keep on giving us good movies time and time again. I hope so too. Thank, thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you.